Welcome back. Pike Place Market is one of Seattle's most iconic landmarks, famous for its fish throwers, fresh flowers and produce and amazing local art. What people don't often see is the role the market serves in its community. We met with Lillian Sherman to show us some of the amazing things happening behind the scenes. So the market is so much more than the fish, flowers and produce that our visitors see when they arrive. It is truly a community of thousands of people. It all started back in the 70s when the market was saved from the wrecking ball. And at the same time they preserved the buildings that you see, they also preserved the 500 low-income housing units that you see when you look up around the market. In addition to those residents, we have social services that you see. Um, if you look around, you will see a food bank, you'll see a senior center, you'll see a clinic, you will see an assisted living facility, and you'll see a preschool. This is Rachel the Piggy Bank. She was born in 1986 and, and sculpted by a woman named Georgia Gerber. She was modeled after an actual Rachel the Pig. She is the biggest pig philanthropist you'll ever find. She is a piggy bank and she raises about $20,000 a year that all goes into the services here in the market. Rachel is definitely the mascot of the market and she looks over all of the things that are happening. She also makes sure that she's caring for the Pike Place fish guys on a regular basis and she tells people regularly how to get to the gum wall. On any given day, rain or shine, people come to see the gum wall. <laughs> We are the oldest continuously operating produce stand in the market. By Terry, we have been here since 1943. And every, every generation of owners has been family. So we're the sixth generation of owners and we're family. But so one of the things that visitors don't know about the Pike Place Market is the food that you see is often handpicked by the vendors. And, and so much of what you see also contribute to our food bank. They help us with matching dollars for lower income shoppers. And they contribute every day by gleaning through the market. And the, and the cool <laughs> program right now from November 1 to May 31 is the matching EBT program. Right. So people on food stamps, when they shop here, if they get their card from you guys, they pay half of everything they pay and then you guys match that other half back to us, which Correct. lets us make sure these people are getting some really good quality produce that, that you know they can really enjoy it. It's super cool. Welcome to the Pike Place Market Food Bank. Another of the hidden gems in the Pike Place Market that most people don't even know is here. We are in the parking garage of Pike Place Market and this is Stella. She runs the show here. Hi, welcome. I'm the food bank manager. Yeah, um, so here at the food bank we have three main programs. Our first is grocery distribution where folks come to the food bank to shop for fresh groceries. <laughs> um, people can come once a week and we serve about 1,000 households every week. Um, so yeah, over 4,000 individuals every month. Uh, when people come, they get about 20 pounds of groceries in all sorts of different categories. Um, our second program is our home delivery program. We do deliver to about 110 individuals per week who are living in downtown Seattle and who are homebound. They're not able to come down to the food bank, so we go to them. And with that, they get a grocery bag of about 15 pounds. We try to get all five food groups. Uh, our third program is our no cook bag program for individuals who are experiencing homelessness or who don't have access to a kitchen. This is a smaller to-go bag of ready-to-eat non-perishable foods. Uh, we give out about 300 of those per week when we're fully stocked. Wow, yeah, that's amazing. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs>